Hello, hello, OGB family. Welcome to Saturday Bible Study and Fellowship. And I guess you should really call it more of just like maybe a, a Saturday teaching. Um, Cause I'm just gonna share straight from my heart, uh, just a word that I feel that I need to hear and I hope that it blesses you as well. Um, do you, I mean, have you forgotten who you are? Okay, do you not remember the beautiful, powerful, talented person that God created you to be? Have you been through so much trauma and drama until now you're starting to believe the lies of the enemy? Well, I'm here to tell you today that look, you are still that same person and even better than before. Hallelujah. Because through your trials and tribulations, you may not notice it right now, but you are now stronger. You now have more gifts, more insight, more wisdom, and it's going to be better than ever before. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The story does not stop with Joseph in the jail hallelujah the story does not stop there hallelujah there's more chapters to be added ha glory be to god more books to be written more songs to be sung so it's not over hallelujah and for the believer it continues all into eternity those blessings that breakthrough that god has for you so I just want to encourage you right now, hallelujah, hallelujah, that the best is yet to come. And the good thing about being a follower and a lover of God is that it keeps on getting better and better. Hallelujah. Only God's best for you. So I just want to remind you that the Lord says that you are more than a conqueror. The victory is already yours. I just want to remind you that no weapon formed against you shall prosper because you are highly favored and loved by God. Thank you, Jesus. The testing and the building of your faith is not to destroy you, but to build you, to launch you into the next realm that he has for you. And I know it's not always easy because I'm walking through it myself. And I just remember one day I was thinking to myself, like, I, you are your hero, God in you. Look at all the things you've been through and where you are today. You could have been so many other things. You could have given all the way up. And though you may have had times where you slip or you slide a little bit, you always had enough in you to come crawling back to God saying, Lord, I don't want to be anywhere without you. Take a moment to admire the strength within you. The fact that you would even take the time out to still be running after God, even though at times you may feel disappointed, it shows that God is for you. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. Be not discouraged for the best is yet to come and is going to keep on getting better and better and better. And as I was just thinking back into my childhood and I just remember myself as a teenager, I was just always excited, always expecting the best, always had that energy, that positive glow about me, encouraging others, never was a hater, none of those things, godly good esteem from the start. And I said, you know what? That's a beautiful thing. And I know it's only because of him, but I just wanted to take that moment and say, you know what? You are the hero that you've been looking for. God is within you. God gave you everything that you need. As I was reading Genesis today, and it was talking about when God was uh, commissioning Moses to go and to rescue his people and Moses kept giving God excuses oh they're not going to believe me so then God you know showed him how he would show his power through 
uh, you know, when his his staff and just all the different things. And even after that, seeing God's power, Moses still was not convinced that he was the one to go. And he was like, well, Lord, what about my speech? What about my speech, Lord? My speech isn't right. And God was like, do you know who you're talking to? <laughs> you are talking to God. I got you, Moses. Just go and do what I say do. But, oh, Moses would not stop. He actually made God mad, but God just, you know, went along with it and said, well, look, your brother, he'll speak. He'll speak on your behalf. And I just want to tell you and remind you, you already got everything you need inside of you and with God to achieve all of those desires he has within you. Just take the first step using what you have hallelujah just take that first step and be faithful because remember do not despise small beginnings because if you're faithful over few, the lord is going to expand your territory that reminds me of the prayer of jabez oh lord bless us indeed and enlarge our territories may thy head be with us and keep us from evil and god you have granted us what we requested so I just want to come on here real quick to remind you of that. Hallelujah. I'm doing like a health uh, fast that's going to be breaking in a few minutes. So I just want to come and share with you all. I pray that God will bless you above, beyond, front, side, back, every which way, north, south, east, west, you and your family, that you will experience experience his joy like never before. Let me know in the comments who you are. Put it in the comments. I am the child of the most high God. Highly favored. I love you all. Make sure to like and share the video while it's available. And remember, only God's best for me and you. Hallelujah.